it's the kingpin ready to have some fun now what we talking about today <laughs> If this is your first time watching this video, or if you've watched many videos and have yet to subscribe, come on, hit that subscribe button, show the Buffalo Fanatic some love, and of course, hit that bell notification, cause you have to be notified after all these bangers. Let me start off this video by emphasizing what I said on my last video. This ain't the same old Bills. Duke! Duke Williams in the red zone the dude is a monster. He showed that in preseason, and then he showed it in the first game. Duke caught every ball thrown his way. And that's exactly what we're looking for in the wide receiving core. It just feels so good when you know that years past, you would lose games like this. Years past, we've always known that the Bills would lose games like this. The balls normally wouldn't bounce the Bills way. So this is why you have to take advantage of games like this. We're keeping the streak alive for four out of the five weeks. And you can even make an argument that if he was healthy last week, it would have been five for five. Captain Clutch. Can't say enough about Josh Allen and how big he plays in the fourth quarter. It was tied 7-7. We didn't really have momentum. And Josh Allen, with the help of Brian Dable, had an amazing drive to get that 14-7 lead. So a huge shout out to the offense especially your boy Captain Clutch. Another thing that stood out was the pass rush. You see, we struggled this year generating sacks. We were creating pressure, but the sacks weren't there. Today, the defensive line went to work. Huge shout out to Jordan Phillips with his three sacks. Good game, man. So the Bills beat the Titans 14 to seven. Go four and one into a bye. And then after the bye, the Bills play the Dolphins. Let's go. Huge shout out to everyone that's watching this video. And let me remind y'all, this ain't the same old Bill.